We share our world with over a million different insect species. Most insects do us no harm. They're a vital part of our ecosystem. They're food for other animals. They help recycle dead things. Many plants can't reproduce without insects to pollinate them. Imagine a world with no fruit. But a handful of insects have become our enemies. Insect pests can eat our crops or destroy buildings or transmit diseases like malaria and Zika virus. The cost of insect damage to crops is vast and each year one million people die from diseases caught from insects. At the moment we control these pests using chemical insecticides but these have major problems. Insects develop resistance and insecticides are indiscriminate. They harm many other animals including helpful species like honeybees. We need precision pest control. So how can we target insect pests without harming other species? Our research looks at turning off insect genes. Individual genes can be turned off with inhibitor molecules called double-stranded RNA. Turning off a gene means that the insect can't make a particular protein. And this deficit can kill the insect or alter its biology. This could be really useful in pest control. It could also stop insects from passing on diseases. But how do we get the inhibitor into insects? Scientists have tried lots of methods, like injecting and feeding, which can work in the lab. But it's difficult and expensive, because we need to make lots of inhibitor. This strategy won't work in the wild. Our idea is to get bacteria to make and deliver the inhibitor for us. But any old bacteria won't do. They have to be special friendly bacteria that live only in the insect's gut. These bacteria are called symbionts. They keep an insect healthy and help its digestion. We modify the friendly bacteria so that they produce the inhibitor. The bacteria are taken up by the insect and go back to living in its gut. Here they continuously produce the inhibitor, which turns off a target gene in the insect host and the bacteria can be passed on to other members of an insect colony and even their offspring. We call this technique Symbiont Mediated RNAi or SMR. SMR is highly targeted. The inhibitor is designed to only target a gene that is unique to one insect species. This stops it from turning off any other gene in other animals. Insects and symbiont bacteria evolved together over thousands of years. These special bacteria can survive nowhere else in nature. This means they won't infect other species of insect or other animals, and they can't infect you. Right now, we use SMR to study how genes work in insects. But we aim to develop SMR for controlling insect pests in the wild or to prevent them from transmitting diseases.